Hi, I'm Jaden, and I'm here to, to talk about kites. They are like dragons. And the movie How to Train Your Dragon already tells you that. But you don't, you don't know how to train a kite. Well, I actually have two specialists who are kite experts. Why don't we go talk to them? So, how's it like training kites? It's a very hard process. It takes uh, years of experience to learn how to fly kites. It's the best job in the world. Is there anything you would like to share with us about kites? <clears throat> they are very hard to train sometimes. Sometimes they don't like to be cooperative. It's really hard sometimes to get them to cooperate. Has there ever, ever been a kite that has died before? Sadly, yes. There's been several. It's... It's been hard. It's... <clears throat> It's hard. It's hard losing as many kites as we did. But you gotta keep going. You can't, you can't let one or five stop you from training kites to fly. Have any of them been killed by a person? No. Wait, what? Oh. 36. But most of them just commit suicide. What are some of the play areas in your yard for the kites? I have a pond. They're very scared of that. I've had one. Friedrich. Friedrich. He is blue and yellow and green, and orange, and purple, pink, no. he's black, pink. he's brown, he what's that? He's not pink. He's orange, he's, he's yellow, did I say that already? He's, okay. he's yellow and teal. But he's not teal. He's not teal. His favorite activity is rollerblading. He has a sister named Louisa, and his doctor's name is Dr. Anchovy. He had a tragic accident, but he was one of the lucky few that survived. And we put him through therapy. Therapy took a while. He he didn't like to cooperate with us. And I mean, you know how that is. Going through therapy is not pleasant, and I believe that one of these days he'll he will succeed and fly again. Friedrich was flying. It was a gustly day, and um, he lost control, and he plummeted into the pond. He was brought out and given CPR. He was underwater for six and a half hours while we tried to reel him in. And we gave him CPR and he is in recovery. What kind of schooling did you go through for being a kite trainer? I began in preschool. I then graduated to elementary school. I passed on to middle school. Graduated to junior high. Then high school. I went to kite college. Some scouts noticed me and snatched me into the business. 
Have you ever hit one of the kites by accident or on purpose? I've never hit a kite. I will never hit a kite. That wasn't me. You gotta patch up. Patch I, can, I can patch a good patch a good kite up. I can sew like a like a grandma. Like my great grandma. Like her great grandma. She's amazing at sewing. Who's amazing at sewing? You need to get closer. For all of you who were wondering, this is Raja. Our tiger. This one is our tiger. Um, I suggest you don't get closer to the do not, do not get close. Okay, well, what's one more question that I could ask you? <laughs> I'm going to add some of this stuff out.